one of the most blessed doctrines in all of the Bible, uh, one of the most encouraging doctrines in all of Holy Scripture, uh, really could be found in Romans chapter 8 and verse 1, where the Apostle Paul says, Therefore, we have no condemnation. There's no condemnation for those who are in Christ Jesus. And that doctrine is the union with Jesus Christ. The believer's union with Christ is so comforting, it is so encouraging, it is so refreshing, it is so strengthening, and it stimulates holiness, and it gives assurance to the believer who is struggling with life. The union with Christ is contained in this Pauline phrase that he uses again and again and again, in Christ, in him. We are in him. We are united with Christ. We are joined with him. That is to say, all that Jesus Christ is, is mine. All of his righteousness is mine. All of the protection that Jesus Christ has, being God and being right now in heaven, seated at the right hand of God, exalted above the heavenlies and interceding for believers, I am raised up with Christ and I have been seated with him in the heavenly places. That all is unveiling this blessed doctrine of the Christian's union with Jesus Christ. It is such a comfort to believers because every believer needs to understand and needs to remember that the union with Christ means that my identity, who I am, is not bound by what I can do. It's not determined by what I can achieve. It's not defined by what I can accomplish for God. But the union with Christ means that my identity is Christ. I am in Christ. I am united to him by faith alone. So what that means is that when life changes, when I sin, when the world crumbles, when I am falsely accused, when everything that I have lived for is taken away and stripped from me, I know that my true identity has not changed because I have been brought into eternal union with the Lord Jesus Christ. That's permanent. That does not change. And that union with Christ encourages the believer. It gives life to the believer. It counsels the believer each day. And it assures the believer in his heart that his salvation is secure because Jesus Christ is is united to me, and I am united to him by faith.